Hi guys, I'm Taylor and today we are going to pack for a ski trip in a carry-on. Let's do it! Yeah. So first and foremost, I want to encourage everyone um, by saying that you can pack in a carry-on for a ski trip. It is extremely doable. I have done it before. Um, and my last video, my last carry-on ski trip video, um, it was about two years ago at this point, I was able to pack in a carry-on. Um, however, that trip was more focused on skiing and relaxing. So a lot of what I packed were comfortable clothes, you know, um, loungewear, leggings, workout tops, sports rust, things like that. Um, now, this ski trip will be more focused um, on skiing and also enjoying ourselves and going to nice dinners or going to some bars. Um, so it's really important that I have um, two different clothes. I have, you know, skiing clothes and comfortable lounging clothes, and then also cute clothes to wear out to go to a restaurant or a bar. Okay, so with that being said, let's get started. I first want to talk about my suitcase. I will be packing in the bigger carry-on away suitcase. I have had away for now maybe five years and I stand by it. It is really good quality and it's really stood the test of time and I highly, highly, highly recommend it. So first on one half of my suitcase, I have my ski suit. So I have a full on ski jacket, full on ski jacket and full on ski pants that are able to fit in here. And at the bottom underneath, my ski jacket and ski pants. I actually have two sports bras and a long john, you know, thermal, um, thermal top in here that's able to fit in there. And then on the second half of my compartment, I have a packing cube. I am now officially a packing cube connoisseur. I love packing cubes. I 100% believe that every single person needs a packing cube. It will change your life, change the way you pack, change the way you travel. They're amazing. But anyways, in my packing cube, this is where I have the bulk majority of the clothes I will wear every single day. So like I mentioned, we have some nice dinners planned and plan to go out to some bars. Um, so I brought some leather pants. As you can see, these pants are from Express and fold down pretty nicely and slim, um, so it doesn't take up too much space. And then I also have this skirt that I'm going to pack, um, just you know, a basic black skirt. Um, and I plan to wear some, you know, tight stockings underneath it because it will be cold. Now for the tops to wear with these two items, I have you know, this basic blue sweater, um, very cute. Um, this doesn't fold down as slimly, so I typically put this on the top. And then I also have two bodysuits. So I have a black turtleneck bodysuit and then just, you know, a basic sweetheart neckline bodysuit. So those are my um, going out nicer outfits um, and clothing I have for whenever we go out. Now moving on to, um, you know, just relaxing, lounging, and when I go skiing, I have some workout stuff. So I have, I will be wearing leggings on the plane, um, and then I have some just shorts, some biker shorts to wear around our Airbnb when we're lounging around. I have a workout top to wear whenever I go skiing, and I also have a long john top, a long john, you know, thermal long sleeve that I will also wear when I go skiing or just lounging around anywhere. And then I have one more workout top. It's a black tank top, folds down very, very easily. And lastly, I have a pair of yoga pants. So all in all, I will have two pairs of yoga pants, two pairs of workout tops, two or one pair of a long john thermal set. So the pants, the, the thermal, um, what do they call it, underwear, um, and the actual long sleeve top, um, and then some biker shorts just wound around it. 
in between what separates my sections in my packing cube, um, I don't know if you can see the pink, are my ski socks and just some very nice fuzzy socks um, to wear when I go skiing and when I'm lounging around. So that is all in my first compartment of my suitcase. Now let's move on to the other compartment. Okay, moving on to our other compartment. Once again, I have a compression sleeve that goes down and um, in this compression sleeve, I have underwear and um, like just undergarments. So any bras or underwear I need, I have in the compression sleeve. And then on the other side, this is where I keep all my shoes and toiletries and just other miscellaneous stuff. So I have a number of toiletry bags. Yes, I have four toiletry bags, but you know you need something for makeup, skincare, hair, washing yourself. Like you just, I don't know why I have so many toiletry bags, but I just do. And I use all of them. I need all of them. Next, I have a pair of pajamas just a, and these fold down very easily so it comes in handy and very easy to pack with then in here i have a swimsuit because our Airbnb has a hot tub um and then i have some, a pair of thigh high boots um, that i'm able to wear whenever we go out to dinner or um, go out these are like my nicer pair of boots and then I also have a pair of combat boots. Um, and these are just my boots I'm gonna wear like when I go pick up my skis and um, you know, just so I don't have to walk around all the time in my ski boots. These will be other more functional boots. And then just wherever I can fit it, I have little socks just nestled in here. And um, so that is really all. That is how I'm able to pack for a ski trip in a carry-on. I just want to echo that packing in a carry-on is extremely doable. Make a packing list, make sure you're organized, um, and let me know if you have any tips or advice um, that you use to pack in a carry-on. Thanks for watching.